Hi, welcome back to Mama Four Boys. Tonight I am making chicken bacon ranch mac and cheese in our new uh, Ninja Speedy air fryer. And uh, so it's our, our first meal we're going to make in it. Hope it turns out good. Uh, so I'm going to start out by putting in in the bottom tray. I'm going to cook two, two levels in this thing. So on the bottom tray I'm going to put one box for 16 ounces of pasta. I'm using the penny pasta. Uh, you can use rotini, you can use any, really any kind you like. Okay, and I'm gonna put in uh, two and a half, two and a quarter cups of chicken chicken broth. That's what I'm gonna put in. Two and a quarter cups, I've got it pre-measured out. Two and a quarter cups in here. Just putting it right into the, right into the unit. I'm gonna put in uh, one and a half cups of uh, whole milk. Okay. I'm going to put in two ounces of, uh, this is Hidden Valley Ranch, uh, powdered uh, ranch dressing mix or uh, seasoning. I'm going to put that in. I'm going to put in a half a cup of, of chopped, I just made bacon and I've chopped a half a cup up. I'm going to put that in there. And I'm going to stir all that together. Uh, and then I'm going to add in uh, 16 ounces of, of Velveeta, okay? I'm going to stir this up and I'll be right back. Okay, I've stirred the uh, mixture together here in the bottom rack, or in the bottom pot. I'm going to go ahead and put in my cheese and add all that in there. Kind of maybe probably get that even around the top because there's no way to mix all this in because it's still not melted. So I'm going to put that on the top there like that. Make sure I got all of it there. All right. Okay, I'm going to get the top rack ready. And in order to do that, you just take your you take your, your crisping rack and you fold the legs out that are on the bottom of it. As you can see, there's four legs. Like so. And we're going to lay that. Put that right in these notches here. See that? The notches there? And seat that firmly in there. And we're going to take our uh, like six or eight uh, chicken tenders. I'm gonna uh, shake those with some seasoning with some sasson and some other seasons that I'll mix together and uh, we're gonna layer those on top of here and then we're gonna set the machine and I'm gonna show you how to do that. It's supposed to be very very easy but this is our first meal so we're anxious to see how it turns out. Stay tuned. Alright welcome back. I've got my top tray in. I've got myself uh, one uh, easy baked chicken uh, package from Kroger. I'm going to use that. I'm also throwing in one little packet of Sazon into the into this mix here and I'm going to uh, uh, mix it all up and bread my chicken tenders in it uh, and then we're going to uh, set this machine and see how it turns out. Uh, we want to thank our good friend Rick from Cooking with Rick. Uh, he suggested to us that we get this machine uh, it took a little while and we finally got it, but it was his idea. He suggested that and, and uh, we're grateful to him for that. Uh, he's a, a wonderful person. So I'm going to uh, and check out his channel and like, share, and subscribe his uh, videos as well, please. Uh, so now I'm going to get the chicken tenders out and shake those up and place them on here and we'll set this thing to cooking. We'll be back. All right, welcome back. You can see I've got my, I have seven chicken tenders in there that I uh, breaded in my breading mix that I told you about. So I'm going to uh, now close the machine and it says to uh, flip the switch up to rapid cooker which I've done and I'm going to now go around to the control panel and show you how I set it. We'll be back. All right welcome back. Now we've got our meal in the cooker and we're ready to start it. Remember we flipped our switch to the uh, rapid cooker mode. We're going to turn the unit on we want it set on speedy meals, which you would just scroll through to get to that. We want it on speedy meals. The temperature is 375. The cooking time is going to be 10 minutes. And you just press start. There we go. And we will be back when this is uh, done cooking and we're after after it cooks, we're going to uh, take the chicken off of the top and Probably slice it up and mix it together with the mac and cheese. We'll be back. All right, we're back. Our chicken uh, is about 180. 
Uh, so it, it, it tempted out perfectly. It looks, and it's very tender looking. Uh, so I'm gonna get the chicken off of there and we're gonna see what's in the bottom tray. We'll be right back. All right, it says to make sure you use Teflon coated tongs to lift the tray out. Wow, look at that. So we're gonna stir this up, mix it together, and plate it up. We'll be back. All right, here's our chicken. I'm gonna slice a couple of those up. I'm gonna put them on my plate with uh, the mac and cheese and bacon. Add some seasonings to it, and we'll have a taste test. We'll be back. Hi, welcome back. It's time for the taste test of the chicken bacon ranch that we cooked in our Speedy Ninja air fryer that I told you about. So we're gonna get us a little uh, of the pasta with the cheese on it and the bacon and a piece of the chicken. Mm, that is out of this world. Wow. Mm. Wow, our very first meal in the, uh, in the Ninja Speedy is wonderful. 10 thumbs up, and I only have two. Uh, this is absolutely incredible, uh, the way this tastes. And it was all just in, in one machine, cooked all at one time together. And uh, the chicken is juicy, tender. Uh, the pasta's done just right. Uh, everything's cooked together well, and it tastes so good. One more bite. Mm, wow. Phenomenal. Mm. Wonderful. So please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Tell your friends about us. Definitely make this meal for your family. Um, it took 10 minutes once I uh, put it in the machine, just like you'll see on the video. 10 minutes and you're ready to plate it up and serve your family. Uh, the cleanup is going to be a breeze. I'm going to clean the bottom pan and that crisper tray. And that's going to be the cleanup for the machine. So that's the one great thing about these machines. So again, please like, share, and subscribe. And until the next time we see each other, enjoy some of this. Have a great rest of your night. And God bless. Here he goes. Bye, car. Boom. Boom. Uh-oh. Better get it.